first bike ever being built by uh, Brandon Hensley right here. I don't know if the world's ready for this. It's just a Paco wishbone. Nothing too exciting, nothing too gaudy. Put a 66 show head in here, four speed. A uh, good friend of ours actually had it. He wanted to buy a truck at the time. So I was actually started to build his motor for him. And I figured I'd take it. So here we are, two years later. Super stoked for him. Remember me and Brandon were in class at MMI, an early model, and we broke this thing down. One of the heads almost fell off the table and took a dive, but I actually caught it on it by luck. Went through and made sure everything was correct, and there it is, completely back together, ready to go in there. Yeah, he's, he's got a pretty nice four speed to go with the deal, too, and we went through that as well. Yeah, he's got a little cool rocker clutch set up for it. It's gonna be really bitching, bitching scoop. More powder coat hardware. He's very meticulous. He's taking his time doing it right. Just tapping all the holes. Getting her all cleaned up so my bolts thread in by hand. Keeps my stress level down. Brandon always has a design in his head. So we just got went off what he wanted and uh, did some cool little exhaust things going on. And sissy bar, tank mount. <laughs> He's been waiting a long time for it. I can't wait to ride it. You're going on your sixth year of this <laughs> You're gonna have it ready for the smoke out. We're Two looking, Sturges. We're probably looking at more Sturges, right? <laughs> <laughs> Hopefully we can make Sturges this year. How long is it going to take you to put you up? Uh, well, we get stuff from Nickel Plate back probably next week. Huh? Probably a week after that. A week or two of uh, working out all the bugs. Then we're going for a ride. 